you hear the spooky dogs behind us? The spooky dogs. <laughs> We're at the Highlands Humane Society, which is home to the Terror Trail in Sebring, Florida. Um, they invited us out here this evening and we're so appreciative to get to experience this event uh, and share it with you, our audience. Yes. Um, one of the great parts about this event is your monies towards the ticket contributes directly to the Highlands Humane Society. So you get scared and you get doing it for a good, good cause. cause. You can't beat that. So come along with us as we walk through this almost mile or mile trail i believe it's like 20 25 minutes let's see what spookiness we can get into yes let's go into the darkness <laughs> <laughs> Ready as I'm gonna be. <laughs> so welcome to the Terror Trail. Terror Trail in spring. Where am I again? Seabird. That's how scared I am. <laughs> this is legit outside. I guess we have to go inside. <laughs> oh, no. oh my gosh. I can't see anything. <laughs> I hope I'm going the right way. Oh, Jesus Christ, I hear <laughs> Wow. Oh, what is that? That's crazy. <laughs> some POV as well as filming oh god me <laughs> the, the tunnel does continue that's what this is it's a tunnel <laughs> all right watch your step I'm not sure where I'm going. I'm not sure. Oh, 
think I'm turning. Are we still? We are still on the top. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I think we're good. I'm fucking <laughs> uh, Thank you. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> Can try to get out of that tunnel. Thank you, boy. <laughs> that 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 was. Cool. I've never experienced something like that because it's so foggy, and they're like whispering in your ear. Oh my gosh! Wow. <laughs> Top notch there. <laughs> oh my god! It was so dark. It is still so dark. <laughs> Can you feel like stuff can just come out of anywhere? <laughs> That's the mystery of a trail. <laughs> Alright, zombie. That one got me good. Alright, going upstairs. Okay. Super disoriented. It's just Scared by a speaker. Oh my god. It's really loud. This is very difficult. Oh, we're on my butt. Oh yeah, we're on my butt. Something's behind me. There probably is. I don't think it. I don't think. It. That's good. Jesus Scarecrows. This one's always fun. Scarecrows are, are nice, right? They, they look nice. This one doesn't look so nice. Very nice scarecrows. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so creepy. Look at this one. <laughs> I knew he was there. I, I, I put the light to his eyes. I was like, oh, your eyes are real. Yeah. Too nice about what I mean, y'all. Oh. <laughs> 
Hey, how you doing? I'm surviving. Here we go, Ed. Go, Ed. I will go. Still go. Where are we going? I don't know where we're going. <laughs> Like that <laughs> it's dolls. <sighs> and there seems to be a lot of fog. <laughs> <laughs> you got scared by the bush? Alright, so we're going into dolls next. Ooh, some creepy dolls. Oh my god, there's a spider. <laughs> I got scared by vegetation. <laughs> That's the thing, you're outside, right? It, you don't know where stuff is coming from. There's behind me. It's people, okay. All right, we are heading into, I'm not sure where. <laughs> Can you see? It's getting very dark, again. <laughs> it's very dark, we're still on the trail. Nothing is jumping at us yet. <coughs> we know where to play ground. <laughs> All right, back on the darkness. Manny, oh, Manny has a red light, so we can use this for our source of light. <laughs> yes, we got it. It's very dark. <laughs> okay, we are entering into some sort of pit maybe or prison I don't we'll be able to read the sign when we get there <laughs> uh. oh it's a sewage plant that's fine you want to go in first since you're doing sure Let's go into the ew. into the switch plant. Open up your whistle too. Oh! Uh. <laughs> bye bye, little birdies! Let me put you in a cage! Oh! <laughs> uh. Alright, we are leaving the sewage department, going into the woods. Not sure what we are about to run into. Oh, the rat trap. 
this will be fine. Not at all. I'm good. Thank you, though. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <Jesus. laughs> Ow. <That's> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Somebody was following me. All right, we made it out of the rat trap, and now I'm trying to see. <laughs> Zombie's mouth. Come on in because oh, no. you cost to make yourself own. <laughs> make sure you got a tennis shot if you decide to take off running. You might need that one. <laughs> Wonderful. Oh, well, you're 
we're about to have so much fun. Oh. Don't get lost though. Okay. I'll Stay try to. <laughs> All right, we're going in a maze apparently. Somebody else is walking. <laughs> okay, okay, we're still going. Oh my god, it's so fucking dark. I cannot see. <laughs> So I'm kind of just following the people in front of me because it is so dark in this woods. We did it. We did it. We made it out. Give yourselves a round of applause. 
<laughs> yeah, you did it, man. Yeah, yeah. Jenna, that was so fun. It was a lot of fun. Yeah. Hey everybody, Manny here with Sean. The Manny and Sean experience. Um, we hope you enjoyed the Terror Trail video. We just wanted to give you a few recap points of what we enjoyed. Um, obviously, we're not there. We had a long drive back. <laughs> so uh, once we were done through the trail, we came back home. Uh, it was it was almost a two hour drive back home. So we wanted to get back home, but. Uh, once again, thank you to the Terror Trail at, in Sebring, Florida. I kept wanting to call it Sebring or something else. I don't know. Sebring, Florida. It's Sebring. <laughs> um, we appreciate them having us out and inviting us to cover their event, especially on their on their closing night. Um, so we're very appreciative um, as content creators. Uh, you always appreciate those invites and are very thankful for it. Uh, the event itself um, was extremely well organized from where you park to how you get uh, to the actual entrance of the um, event. Um, they used the, the speedway near the regional airport in Sebring, Florida, which is literally like, what, less than a minute down the street. <laughs> less than a minute, yeah. um, So they have plenty of parking. It's free, which we love free. Um, and then they had a very nice coach bus that takes you over to the entrance of the event and it picks you up and takes you back. Um, so I thought that was really seamless in terms of an operation. Um, it's important to say everybody at this event from what we're told is a volunteer. So to have such a seamless operation with volunteers was really cool to see. Yeah, it was, like you said, it was very well organized. Um, the bus was comfortable. Uh, so you get a nice ride over. I would suggest, I mean, if you're going next year, because I'm pretty sure they'll do it next year. Is, they should do it next They year, should yes. do it next year. <laughs> uh, is to get there a bit early. Um, we got there around a little after 7. And by the time we like got out the car or whatever, there was already a line to get on the bus. And um, when we returned, there was an even longer line. Yeah. See on the west. So I was just getting there a little bit earlier um, to kind of cut your wait times. But like it was very well organized. When you get there, you get to the ticket booth. They'll give you your tickets and your uh, glow stick. It's one glow of those necklace, glow necklaces um, that allows the actors to know that you are coming because it is very dark. Yes. <laughs> um, the monies that they collect. Uh, go to help the Highlands County uh, Humane Society. Uh, so it's a great um, fundraiser for them. So your money is going to a very good cause uh, in terms of supporting the Humane Society. So it's not just a money grab of an event, yeah. uh, which is something we really uh, liked about them. So uh, your money is going to very good use. Uh, they also have a small concession area where you can buy some snacks. Uh, I recommend doing it afterwards, because, <laughs> uh, like he said, the once you're in the trail, it is very dark. Yeah, the trail is super dark, um, which I think adds to the excitement. It of, does of it all because you're in the woods. You're in an environment that isn't constructed, uh, though you will go through different scenes throughout the forest. Um, just being in the forest and in the dark and. I mean, sometimes I got scared by like leaves touching me because I couldn't see anything, but I could feel things. Um, but yeah, it was a great event. We had a great time. Um, yeah. yeah, one of the highlights for us was definitely <clears throat> the, I don't know what to call it, um, but this, the, the tunnel of fog. That's what I'm calling it. Oh, at the entrance, yes. Um, right from the beginning, you go into a tunnel that is full of fog and strobe lights and when I say full of fog I'm talking full of fog to you can maybe see I don't know point zero because I couldn't see because you. you were in front of me <laughs> um, I was definitely feeling my way around uh, to try to to try to, I don't know fall off the course but the scare actors there I think there was one or two they did a very good job like I don't know how one they saw and two where they came from but 
one of them kept whispering in our ears, which was <laughs> super creepy because you don't know where it's coming from. And then they would appear. Uh, so that was really, really cool effect. Um, but the overall event itself is really nice. There's a couple of different areas that you see, like he said. So there's a, a sludge area, um, which is essentially like something happened in the water, uh, a rat trap. Those faces were scary. Yes. And it was very constricting in there. There was a lot of constricting spaces. <laughs> there, was. Um, there was the swamp saws, uh, a blood harvest, toxic clowns, and then the dolls were all the little themed sections they had. They had this thing called the maze, which literally was a maze. <laughs> and you kind of felt like a rat going through a maze. Yeah. You're like, when is this going to end? And then they had people on the outsides, like banging on the walls. So yeah. You never knew. Uh, when you were gonna get a scare. And I think the speaker in the wall thing worked well. Is it? It kind of made me think of what Universal did this year. Um, so no one was actually there, but there was a speaker, and it was very loud and disorienting. So great job overall with the scares. Yeah, definitely <laughs> enjoyed the event. Uh, we would definitely go back to it. Yeah. Uh, it is worth the drive. It's a good 20, 25 minutes, almost mile long trail. Um, and it truly is a trail. It's not like some Halloween events that tell you it's a trail and then you're just walking in a house. Yeah. Uh, you're literally in the woods and you encounter different scenes throughout the woods. Yeah. There's enough sections where it's dark enough to where you don't know if something's coming out or not. Um, so that's pretty scary. The scarecrows definitely got, got you. I miss them, but... Yes, you did. <laughs> um, but it's also good because they give space between you and the next party. So like, whatever group of number, group of friends or family that you are traveling with, those are the people that go. And then they give some time and space in between the parties so that people can get a good experience. So I really love that too. Yeah. Even though we did catch up with the people in front of us, I, I mean... It, like any haunted attraction, people are going to slow down because they either get scared of something or they don't want to go forward. So you might catch up with people or people might catch up with you. But overall, I enjoyed like having that space in between parties. Yeah, definitely. So sadly, we went on the last night of the event. So they're closed now, but <laughs> hopefully they come back next year. And we definitely recommend checking them out. Yes. Uh, you may want to follow their socials on uh, Facebook and Instagram. You can go to their website, terrortrailsebring.com. We'll put it in the uh, description as well. Um, so you can follow them and see if they do announce their next season. 100% uh, recommended. Uh, and that comes truly as a personal opinion, not just because they invited us out. I truly enjoyed my time in the event. Yeah, it was a great experience. <laughs> it was a great experience, absolutely. I would go, it was just awesome. Like, I've never walked through an actual trail in the woods. I don't, I haven't either. I've always said I've wanted to, and here we go. I've and always I've seen it in, like, TV shows when they do Halloween specials or in the movies, but, like, never actually done one, and this one was really fun. Yeah. And so hats off to all of the volunteers at Terror Trail Sebring. Y'all did an amazing job well organized good scares really awesome event so definitely check them out on their socials hopefully they'll announce another season next year and remember the monies you contribute uh, are going to a very good cause uh, with the highlands county humane society so you get scared you go to a good event and your money goes to a good cause yeah can't beat that well, that'll do it for us. Thanks for joining us. We hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, we ask that you subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Hit that like button. Do all the things. Uh, we're also on Instagram, threads, all that using the same uh, code that we use, M-A-S-X-P-23. My name is Manny. This is Sean. Manny and Sean Experience. We're out. Bye, y'all.